here we are in Greenland at the Camp North. It's an opening week of the season and we will be fishing for an Arctic char for upcoming six days. Uh, as usual, in the beginning, uh, bigger home fish enters the river first and exactly then we will be targeting our flies. What I like about the Greenland and fishing here in July, it is that you have here midnight sun and it, it's never getting dark. So you can fish whenever you want. Daytime, nighttime, you always get a light. And that's perfect. Do you see those waves? That's a, that's a fresh fish coming up. It's only, it's only really tough and hard because uh, you want to fish all the time and there is really little time for, for you to rest because it's a long hikes, back and forth, long hours of fishing, getting back to tent, get to sleep, three, four hours, waking up again, going back to the river. You got to know when to stop fishing, but you know, when you see those big schools of char coming, you just can't, you just can't stop. You're just going for them, going for them, going for them. Look at the size of a fish and how fat it is. Yeah, lovely. Thanks for white money. Because it's always, you know, I will make the last cast and will reel the line in. But suddenly just, you get a grab from the fish. Oh no, I definitely need to do another one. <laughs> and you do that. And then it comes a second, third one. And then you don't count anymore. You just keep on fishing. Fish are biting, doesn't matter, it's nighttime, it's daytime, they're biting actually all the time. Eat, sleep and fish in Greenland. Only that is some, some periods when they reject your flies and don't react to nothing and you see a lot of fish, you cast for them and fish for them, but they completely don't care about it. But then it's those hours when they bite as hell and it can be in the middle of the day, it can be in the middle of the night, whenever. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. Take that fly, man. But to fight that fish on a six weight rod, it's, it's really insane. You give a full pressure, you want to land as fi the fish as fast as possible because you want to release it quickly. And believe me, it's a hell out of the work to, to get that done. You have it in your, in your hand and you have the full power on. After a few fish landed, you feel how your arm is tired even. That is a nice boy. Oh, yeah, boy. Oh, all the way down. Crazy fish, two times in backing. And now it's, I think, one o'clock in the night and the fish has been insane. Hey, 
go. Well, we've been fishing the lower part for four days now, and today we decided to hit the upper part of the river. To get here, we get a nice boat ride through the lake, which took about half an hour. Uh, now ahead is one hour hike, and it's very exciting because uh, it's an opening week and nobody has been fishing yet, these upper sections. So let's go there and see what's happening. It was uh, a nice hike, it took for us exactly one hour and now we are hoping that uh, those pools are full with char and we'll try to get them. It's coming, it's coming. Baba, hey, we go. Woo, what a day. Have it, second cast, and here we go. Lovely. We've been following the fly all the way from another side of the river, trying to grab twice, and just by the feet. Bang! <laughs> I was ready to say that second cast is empty, and was ready to go for the first, third cast, and suddenly from the current came. Nice char and grab my fly. Look at those fins. Yeah, boy. We have him. Second cast. And this beautiful fish. Oh, here you go, boy. Yeah. <laughs> It's coming, it's coming, yeah, hey, you go, first cast again, woo, <laughs> woo, yeah, 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 fish on, lovely, oh, nice jump, took already a few meters of backing, he's running down, oh, I think I have to go down now, crazy fish, six weight rods, and they're giving full pressure, And <laughs> now he's running upstream. Kimberly, okay, thanks for the fight. enough food so we needed to do a really terrible thing to kill one char and eat it for dinner well our trip is going uh, to the end and uh, it's the last day of fishing and today we will take pretty easy just a short hike up to those pools and just fish for pleasure in general all week was really good we are really satisfied because we got a lot of fish actually. Some of them was uh, really nice, big chrome fish, good fighters, which maybe we're about 10, 12 pounds we landed. What we like here that everything is completely wild. You, you, you get a camping, you get a hiking. It's completely outdoors and wildlife. And that's what we preferring actually. <laughs> 